Well, it's not just basketball that fills Alumni Arena this time of the year, as you maybe can see and hear behind us. Lots of sports going on, including indoor track. And right off of practice, right off the floor here at Alumni Arena, director and head coach of men's and women's track, Vicki Mitchell, joins us to talk about the start of your season. You were working hard down there, weren't you? We were. We were. First track practice back, and uh, we're excited to get going. Uh, all right, so your season is underway. Uh, all that off-season preparation and thinking and training and coaching is ready to be put to the test. Give me an idea of how ready your guys and gals are. Well, I think they are more ready than I am, and I was ready about two months ago. So <laughs> we're, we're excited. We can't wait to hit the track and start the season. Uh, your second uh, big meet of the year is the Upstate Challenge coming up on January 25th. Um, tell us a little bit about that meet in particular and what you're looking to accomplish there. That meet for us is is a real fun meet. It's a scored meet and we have a lot of obviously the New York State teams, Cornell, Syracuse, Albany and uh, us and it's a great meet for us to get out there and really get a good first kind of evaluation of where our team is. Uh, scored meet and it really gives us kind of a foundation of where we need to get in the next six weeks heading into the conference championship. How good a feel, and I know you have a good feel for what your team is all about, what your athletes are all about, but but until you start competition, maybe that refines that a little bit, doesn't it? Absolutely. You know, that the first couple of meets of the season are a little bit of a guessing game. We're coming off uh, the, the winter break and the athletes training on their own, so this will give us a real good sense of where we're at. All right, give us an idea of some of the athletes that maybe you're the most anxious to see perform, but some of the ones that we want to be able to keep track of as this season moves forward. One of the really exciting things is we have a lot of conference championships retur cha champions returning, including on the men's side, John Jones in the shot put, an All-American athlete. We have MAC champion Austin Price in the triple jump, Miles Lewis in the 60 meter. You know, it would look really great. And on the women's side, uh, Emma Suchak, who's the defending heptathlon championship and six foot high jumper. That's going to be a fun one to watch. Sure. But across the board, we have a number of very talented athletes and uh, poised to make some big noise. It sounds like you've got pretty good depth. Is that something you have been focused on trying to build the depth of this team? Across the board, between the field events and the track events, we've strived on both the men's and the women's side to have a very even team, equally distributed team, and really making sure that we have competitive athletes in each event. We, uh, we talk so much about, you touched on it a little bit, we talk so much about the runners, we can see them running behind us, um, but it's the field athletes that, are, that have always turned out great performances for here sure. at UB. Um, you know, it, it, indoors is a little funky for them, isn't it? Um, but it gets them rolling towards the outdoor season, doesn't it? Does. It does. You know, for us across the board, the indoor season is really a stepping stone for outdoor, for all of the events. It gives us their groundwork, but uh, where we are located in the Northeast, it's not a huge, huge season for us. Uh, it really is more, let's get ready and make sure we're uh, ready to win championships in the outdoor season. Right. And I, I'm sure as a coach, you'll tell me that the players get a little tired of practicing so much. They, they want to match yes. themselves against other people, don't they? Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, for the track and field athletes that have been practicing since last August, uh, this competition wait is very, very long and they can't wait to get on the track and tear it up. Um, I know you're always excited about every team and every season, but but can you kind of rank where you think you are about this season? What kind of expectations do you have as a coach for this season? I think our coaching staff across the board has very, very high expectations. This is definitely, uh, for both our men's and women's team, the most talented and most hardworking group that we've had. I think we're on the verge of seeing something really exciting this year. All right, well, the track team is going to share some space here at Alumni Arena to get themselves ready for their season. As always, we thank Vicki Mitchell, the director and head coach of men's and women's track, for giving us a good feel for how their season is set to get going. Thanks, Vicki. Thank you.